how has being a father affected your perspective on living? Um, greatly. I mean, Great. it's such a it's such an amazing thing. I don't know if there's any parents in here, but at least one. <laughs> when, that, when that baby comes, you're like something just like shoots you in the heart. Yeah. Something that just is an automatic love, and I see him grow every day. I mean, he'll be seven months tomorrow. Right. And uh, I mean, it's just amazing. I mean, this is maybe just me. I mean, like, I'm like, oh, he's turning his head quicker now. I'm like, that's so amazing to me. Oh. <laughs> Pretty soon he'll be dunking. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, I get up and walk. Do some. But it's just, it's just a, you find joy in the smallest stuff because yeah. you just look at such such a precious, innocent life, yeah. and it just. Man, it's so awesome, and it really does change your perspective on things. Where now, all of a sudden, this hand, like, whatever. I yeah. mean, like, I'm, I'm, I'm doing stuff for my son, you know, trying to be the best dad, best husband I can be. Yeah. And, uh, I mean, so, it, it's just awesome. I, I really, I, I'm speechless because it really is like that when you have kids. Awesome, John. How about you? With three and a fourth on the way. This might be different. He has older ones. So. Yes. <laughs> uh, okay, he'll be five. Um, I mean, when I had my my son, I was more scared than anything because I had any experience with kids, like no babysitting, no little <laughs> brother, <laughs> sister, and I'm the only child, like nothing, like zero. So, yeah. Like couldn't change a camper, couldn't. <laughs> you know, you learn quickly, bottle. bro. Yeah, I mean, you <laughs> learn quick because I mean, there ain't no instruction, man. Like at the hospital, it's pretty much like, all right, here's your baby. All right, go. What are you supposed to do? <laughs> um, feed it, clean it, feed it, clean it. Yeah. So it was a little like scary, and it was you know kind of walking on eggshells, but um, I mean, we got used to it. Um, but for whatever reason, my second was my daughter. Like for whatever reason, like uh, when I had my daughter, it was kind of like I don't know, like everything. Like it was I don't know, I don't know what it is. Like like I guess it's my son. You know, I'm gonna beat him up, treat him rough. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like but whatever. With my daughter, it was kind of like I don't know. It's like, yeah. Something at you at a different level. Yeah, it was like I don't know, it was like a precious. Yeah. He's speechless right now. <laughs> <laughs> that just goes. I don't know how people wait to find out sex. I mean, if you do, that's great, awesome. But I'm saying, like, my mindset would have to be completely different if I had a girl. Right. Yeah. Yes. So, yeah. Yeah. So I have, right now we have uh, two boys and a girl. So, like, uh, even like my my youngest, he's like, he's. Probably the toughest out of all of them. He only won already, but he's like, he, he's a beast. So, like, a one year old beast. Yeah. <laughs> but for whatever reason, like, my daughter is like, I don't know, it's just something different, buddy. Okay. <laughs> you can truly say that you have seen John Salmon tongue tied. <laughs> tongue tied. That's phenomenal.